All right. So this will be an unboxing video of the Dominator HDV freeze, HD freeze. I should get my straight pack straight here. Let me put it here. Turn it around. So this is the brand new Dominator HD free, just arrived yesterday. And uh, this is the unboxing video, so we can take a look what's inside of the package. Hello viewer, and thanks for joining us. As you can see, this is a softer card box as the previous one. The uh, product code is FSV1076 on this. And uh, specifications FOV42 degrees diagonal, IPD changes between 59 to 69 and um, it has an SVGA 800 by 600 display, supports side-by-side -side 3D, NTSC PAL auto sensing, high definition interface can do 720p support, modular head tracker bay, modular receiver bay, DC in its 7 to 30 volts and power consumption 4 watts. It has an integrated DVR. I can't read and talk in the same. Yes, uh, Dave Gregg is here. And just one second. Can you wait like yes. five minutes no. till I finish this? Thank you. All right, I have a customer in the meantime. But So this is the new HD3. And the top of the box, it's a little bit soft, so careful. Don't push it in too much. It's a soft panel, as you can see when you open it. There it reveals the tall zipper case, which will cover the goggles and all the things inside. On the bottom there is a little tray where uh, the phone, the faceplate phones are hidden. There is a soft one and a softer one. Actually this is a little bit tougher and this is a soft one and there is a velcro and underneath you can find the manual, the QC inspection card and some fetch shark stickers my friends. That's what you are missing. Put it on your quads. Um, all right, so that's back, and then what's in the zipper case? In the zipper case, after you open it, we've got the cleaning cloth, right? You've got the all known white HDMI cable, it's a mini HDMI to mini HDMI. We've got uh, the 1800 milliamp battery. With the LEDs on, if you push the button, if I can, you can see the LEDs coming on on this one, and you are well, you know about this already. Two adapters, a mini HDMI and a standard HDMI adapter. And you see a battery charging lead with banana connectors. Then uh, uh, you have an RCA cable with a four prone connector which goes inside the goggles to feed either video in or video out as you like. Um, lots of people are confusing this with other manufacturers. If you buy these cables from other manufacturers or dollar store, that's not gonna work with your uh, fetcher goggles or immersion products. Okay? We have the well-known faceplate. As you can see, this one already has the HD3 on it, so you will not be able to confuse it with anything else if you buy this. HD2 doesn't have or HD doesn't have this sticker, but this one has the HD3 here already. Um, the receiver bay, well known for all of us, right? And uh, on the other side, we have the head tracker bay. There you go, if you need to put in a head tracker. Um, on the bottom, we have the well known sliders for the IPD adjustments, right? You have, we have that uh, data plug, the RX on and off button, uh, a headphone port, and then the mini HDMI port for feeding in uh, uh, digital signal. It also has the DVR slot in the middle, and the DVR works as uh, we know on uh, the previous models as well. You can plug in the battery lead into the fan, to power on the fan, you push the button and at that point the fan is going to go on for about 8 minutes and turn off afterwards, right? Um, one feature about these goggles which wasn't available at the previous one is going to auto detect the 16x9 to 4x3 signal. 
So if you feed in, as na natively this is a 4x3 four, four image, but if you feed into the HDMI 16x9 image, it's going to crop the top and then you will see a widescreen image coming on. So this is it guys, enjoy, still available, I have a few pieces left, if you want to order them, this is it. Now compared to the HDV2s, these uh, provide a much crispier image as you can see, there is no lens, correction lens is included into this one because the FOV is a little bit sl uh, smaller, and with that you get a crisp image all over. Um, Gerald, yes, please run and come and pick it up. These are yours. No problem. <laughs> Anytime, my friend. So, thank you for watching. And uh, see you soon here when you come and buy it. Bye-bye.